Welcome to Let's Play Discuss Double Dragon 3 The Sacred Stones for the NES. This is Ron Moore along with the J Man, the Wee Guy, and the Purple. Yeah. Gag you. Alright, so now we're in stage four, Italy. I prefer Italia. I wonder if we'll run to Santina or Santino Morella. Too bad Star Sword is not here for that reference. Oh! Yeah. Uh, well, I, I see the Ultimate Warrior throwing knives at you. Yeah, really? <laughs> really? Doesn't look like him. I love the track in the stage. <laughs> this stage yeah. kind of reminds me of Golden Axe. Here's again. Well, oh. the, well, the Ultimate Warrior had longer... Or, I mean, this character had longer hair. What? Was he just as oily? Uh, that's up to you to decide. Yeah. <laughs> there's, lo there's always lots of oil. Time for oil change. <laughs> yeah. And time for a subject change. <laughs> yeah, really. A topic change. Uh, like I said, this stage right here really reminds me of Golden Axe. This, this is what Golden Axe would look like on NES right here. Most likely. You got great music and, and great background. Ancient. Ancient yeah, stuff. Rome. Yeah, ancient Rome, or well, technically Italy, but whatever. You, yeah, you know what I mean. Was it Rome in Italy? Yes. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Oh, it is. Geography. Oh. I kind of thought, but I figured there was a woman here, and she would know. See, I, I didn't retain anything I learned in high school. I actually made a 99 average for the whole like, semester in ge world geography, and I can't remember anything. Wow. Well, geography yeah. doesn't matter anyway, so. Well, I just studied and studied and studied, but I just can't retain. It's like math, who uses that in real life, you know? It's just... no point. Yeah, what idiot needs money and math? Well, you know, advanced math, trigonometry. Oh, yeah. I mean, basic math, of course, but who... nah. Advanced, forget about it. Watch out, someone's gonna post a comment, You do need math in every situation! And well, then, yeah. I told this one girl, I told this girl, I've been busting tables for years, how am I gonna use math in that situation? Well, Let's say five busters divide by three tables in 20 minutes. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Wait, you can't do five that's by three. That's not called that's math. That's called logic. That's uneven. <laughs> well, just an example of that. Um, so is there any reason why you're using the uh, ran, uh, ragu guy? Because uh, of... Billy is dead right now. And uh, the other guy, Chin. Yeah, so I'm using the second best kit uh, other than Jimmy. Jimmy and Bill, Bimmy, the same thing, but one player game so Ranzu, Ra Ran Razor Ramon whoever Shinobi over here is the best character I can use right now but he's not gonna last long yeah pretty much Shinobi <laughs> yeah yeah I, I figured Chin wasn't gonna be worth a shit oh, speaking uh. of oh is crap that... now we get to... now <laughs> yep here we go. I mean, he's Iron Claw is, is good, but only for, like, boss battles, and he moves like a freaking tank. He's so slow. He's got fast hands, though. He's like a, a slim E-Honda. Yeah. There you could have E-Honda right here. The 100 hand slap. <laughs> Whoa. Dang it. Freaking Ryan Howell's back. That looks like, uh, I don't know, Bret Hart or something. <laughs> no, he's not. Or Bret Hart without the pink, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> now it looks like another. It looks like a wrestling jobber, heavy metal Van Hammer. Ow, I'm getting hammered by a beer bottle. Look at this. See? Come on. Plus that fast hand. What's the? Oh, Cheap. Yeah, you need. Yeah. <laughs> this guy. Yeah, oh man. Need a helicopter kick here. This guy. Yeah. This guy right here. This fucking guy. Hey, green's not supposed to be here. Thank <laughs> God! Oh my God! <laughs> Wait a minute! Look at the look at the wall over there in the left. You can see through the wall. That's just that's just NES stuff. No. Oh. Well, there's another. Oh. This NES stuff right here. Game over. Now what's up? Now what? ECW mode? No, Billy mode. Reload mode. Yeah. Safe state mode. Oh come on! There we go. You know, speaking of green, at least this is, uh, the audio is, you know... Yeah, that's, uh, yeah, 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 I'm missing that part one. Yep. Uh, the classic, 
classic Double Dragon 3 Genesis. Oh, what a... Yeah, that's still not uh, completed yet. I think well, it's going to be incomplete for a long time. Probably till the end of time. Yeah. And that's okay. Well, we got a strike in our account saying you cannot upload incomplete LPs. Please hurry up and complete this LP within one week or this channel will be shut down. Like, really? Stupid. Oh, come on. That's a lame joke. <laughs> okay, well, okay, that must be a young Mr. Leahy I've been killing, because, uh, beer bottle. Oh, it's gotta, always gotta assume it's Mr. Leahy. Why yeah. couldn't it have just, why couldn't it have just been some, you know, guy who likes to drink? You know, some random guy. Who could drink more than Mr. Leahy? Uh... Me. Yeah. <laughs> Me. Maybe Stone Cold Steve Austin, uh, that's it. Yeah, maybe it's a... Yeah, I don't know. Oh. It's like Ailes and Stone Cold. Oh. Oh, sudden air burst from J-Man's side. That was weird. Alright, here's the boss of stage four. Timothy McBain. Whoa, he's got a buff chest. Yeah. Actually... Nice observation, you guy. <laughs> what? Actually, no, the, the boss, this boss's name is Brock Lesnar. Uh, what is that, Big Ass Sting? <laughs> oh! So, Brock Lesnar is the boss of this stage, which is the second to the last stage. And I guess freaking Paul Heyman is the boss of the game. Oh! I love this boss battle music though, right here. Yeah, put this in the ring. Yeah. Play it in the ring! Gonna have some... Uh, uh. <laughs> I can't make wrestling rep jokes. They're not my thing. Oh! But wrestling is a joke, though. Oh! Burn on wrestling fans. Take it. ECW. ECW. Get it? I'm calling your your favorite hobby a joke. That's the joke. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm... All right, Jay Lim. I'm sorry. It's 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 past my bedtime. You know, I need to get some warm milk for bed soon. <sighs> Oh, please. <laughs> who, who, is, who even has warm milk for bread? Bread? Bed? <laughs> you just, just shut up. I just... Well, you know, gotta fill in the time while you do your triple kin kick spins. Well, fill the time with more better commentary. Well, hey, at least I'm saying something. Well, say this. Uh, oh, I just lost. Oh, I just lost. <laughs> Did I do it? No, you gotta say, Ryan just lost. Oh, Ryan just lost. <sighs> okay, so it? we had to watch you switch characters. <laughs> yeah. Riveting. Oh. Come on, you're a ninja. You can beat this guy. Oh, use a uh, sh shuriken. Yeah, I'm trying to. It's not doing it. What the heck? Sure you can. Oh, there we go. Broken controls? Come on. Broke back mountain. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. oh, sorry. I was thinking of you, v Oh. <laughs> nice. This guy's tough. Take shurikens like that. Come on. Buff chest, man. He can like yeah, right hail him. Right the, mm. I'm hitting him in his legs. No, oh, that's in the nuts. Right. Like J-Man wants the nuts. Plant? He, he's nuts for nuts. Finally. Jeez. All right, mission five. Hey, Egypt. you had six. You had six shurikens left. Six out of ten. That's <laughs> how drunk that guy was, or the other guy he had the beer. Or maybe Mr. you tonight. Not me. I don't drink. <laughs> uh, this stage right here. Ah. All right, don't die. Jump right. Come on. Come on, get on Mr. Pharaoh's head. Hey, welcome to Mega Man 4. I'm here, Pharaoh Man. It's always the best part of Double Dragon, the freaking platforming. Why do they even bother? I don't know. Dang, I, I forgot Billy's dead. Um, the, Billy. the select stuff in that screen there is kind of tricky. I hit select or a certain button and you're trying to go up and down and you can't do nothing. Wait, Billy Idol's dead? No! Aww. I think it's really retarded that you have to select between their uh, two attacks. Oh, throwing the R word around. That's right. Okay, you could so... have just, just said it was stupid, but okay. <laughs> no, it was uh, gay too. Oh. 
I mean, there's nothing, nothing that would, they can't relate. It doesn't relate. It doesn't make sense. Logic. It was really death. Okay, that's better. Alright, so welcome to The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time for NES. I'm here about the approach to Spirit Temple. Mm. Ooh, Spirit Temple. Yeah. That freaking, um, chick in the Spirit Temple. She was nice. Yeah. Oh, Nabaru. Nabaru, yeah. Yeah, yeah Nabaru. <laughs> yes. Or, um, or my Nabaru. friend, or my friend uh, Heather, or Krishanka, who used the name Nabaru on MSN. Really? Mm. Yeah. For years I thought it was Naboru. And then I like heard her announce it. Nabaru. I, 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 messed, I butchered a like, lot of Zelda names. Is that like how you say neighbor in Japan? Nabaru. Yeah. <laughs> I remember uh, in stage three when you, when you fight Ranji right here. He goes, "You can't beat me. my Ninpu or whatever is is impossible to beat." I go, "Ninpu nipple? Your nipple is impossible to beat? What?" Whoa! Titty twister. Yeah, nipples no. cut through glass. <laughs> I would not want to be a part of that. I would. Play Spirit Temple Mission Lady. Whoa! The friendly spirits where? <laughs> Getting friendly with seen, some. I haven't seen purple face palm this hard in a long time. About what? <laughs> uh, commentary here. <laughs> We're trying to commentate over this repetitive gameplay. But we've barely had this commentary is nowhere near as uh, hot as other times. Well, at uh, least at least our commentary is audible. Uh, but in this case, it might be better if it's not. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah, come dude. on! Uh, yeah. Really? <laughs> Right off the gate. They were waiting for you. <laughs> oh shoot! Let me let me jump. Oh, up. now you're fucked. Oh come on. What? The spikes? Yes. Wow. Hey, come on. Wow. <laughs> what was that? That was a combo break. That was game over. It was me getting pwned. Oh now what? Now what? I got Bi Billy Bear hands now. Oh. Oh uh, what? Oh shoot! Dang it! Really? Wow. Run, you idiot! Double tap four means run. How stupid are you? you freaking buff bag will wig brand. Come on, there you go. Wow, Ronnie Rage. It's rare right. to see you in the wild. You Where, oh. end up oh. There what the we heck go. What is going on? Oh, auto scroll. Yeah. Don't fall in spikes. Ah, oh, there we go. All right. Jeez, why would they do this? All right. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, you gotta jump. Oh my god. Where is your where is your safe states now? <laughs> nah, forget this. Whoa. Shinobi. Yagyu. I know. American Gladiator's here. You decide it's not American Gladiator's for second chance. Yeah. Oh man. And the S version's the best. Probably is. I never played it, but it's gotta be. It's pretty good, you know. Does the soundtrack change? D different tracks? Oh yeah, it's then it's that automatically is better then. Much better soundtrack. Unique too. Well, the Genesis version only had one track. That's sad. And it kept looping no matter what happened. Man, that is. That is Speaking of tracks, cool. this stage right here, all, all the tracks in this stage is pretty awesome. I think every track in this game is pretty epic. Oh yeah. I mean, Technos can't let down in that in that uh, department. Yeah, and I listened to your 8-bit stereo a little bit the other day, because I was like, yeah, I gotta listen to this, and it's cool. Thanks, yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Doesn't get as much love as the other two. Yeah. Frankly, I don't even think the Double Dragon 2 soundtrack is that good anyhow. Oh, shoot, I do. I mean, it's good, but it's not like I wouldn't put it in the top. I mean, the tracks are very, like, mm, I guess simplistic is to put it. Yeah. That's not a bad thing, it's just... I mean, I can... I can just... Yeah, you know, but it's, to me it's also about nostalgia. That too, I didn't grow up, but... I mean, I have none of that to factor into any of my love for this music. <laughs> well, let's see if you... Purple can factor in some commentary. <laughs> oh, just calling you out. Some... What? No, I'm just trying to picture something over there. <laughs> I agree. Oh, um, what? Oh, what? Yeah, what? I agree. What? I absolutely what? agree. I don't know what we got thinking, but anyway, <laughs> it's just, he's it's like, just "Oh my god, a girl!" No, it's just you're, it's like it's like you're, it's like you're upset. There you go, we you. got. There's a girl right there. Oh, oh we got what? Uh. Is 
that your next team member? Oh, okay, thanks. Thanks. That's we guys, girl. <laughs> oh, she asked you to enter the room with her. They're tearing me apart. Oh, hi, old woman. Haruku, whatever her name is. Oh, Haruku. hi, Now oh, wait a minute. Oh, hey, what's up, guys? Wait, whoa. Hey, you're, you're my friends. What are you attacking me for? It's the Shadow Warriors, right? Yeah. I'm your masters anyway. I'm your masters. I'm your master anyway. The masters. Master. The master. master. Chris Masters. Well, that's an obscure reference. It's a master. The Star Soldier was here. <laughs> What do you yeah, which purple? she just she just referenced Mortal Kombat. Oh, I didn't even hear. She said it was Scorpion and Sub Zero, but I guess it's Sub Zero now and in purple. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What do you say, purple? We watch out because purple is the boss of this game. Rat row. Quite literally. Yeah, again, love this track. The way this game looks, this could be like The Mummy Returns for the NES or something. Oh, yeah. Brandon Brazier? That yeah. one? There's a video game, The Mummy Returns. I never played it, though. Mummy Returns? Oh, yeah, there was a video game on the But the one I think the one The Rock is in for a brief period. Oh, the Scorpion King. Oh, wait, yeah. Well, no, Scorpion the, King, the, the Scorpion actually... King was a spinoff. What's yeah. this series? What's this old hag doing? We gotta get your girl out of here. I lied to you. Your friend Bret Hart tried to warn you, but I silenced him. And through sacred stones of power, I must get the force to control the well. <laughs> hey, what? Whoa! What the fuck was that? What the heck happened? Heroku didn't bitch. know the entire legend of the sacred stones of power. It says she who enters the tomb carrying a less than all four stones will be turned to dust. You see, in her haste to obtain power, Haruko made a mistake that cost her her life. So she ah, that's what you get, you old hag. It says she who enters, so if a man enters, I guess... Yeah, I guess so, because we're in there now, and Renju's a man, he's not turned to dust. And now you have to fight mummies. Speaking of, see, the mummy returns. Whoa, did I just hear the windows sound? What was that? Oh yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> six uh, six o'clock every day, my computer does an error that makes an error noise for some reason. I don't know why, but anyway. Okay, um. <laughs> don't play I'm games around six o'clock. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess around uh, what is it here? Uh, around. Dang it, Jamie made me think say around because it was around six o'clock. What was I gonna say? Uh. I guess I'm fighting the great Kali here, mummified. He's doing those Kali chops. Kali? This is retarded. I can't believe this is Double Dragon anymore. This is... But, yeah, I mean, it, you know what? I'll give it credit for trying something new with new characters. It's a fresh concept in the series, but geez, uh, this, Ranzu's alright, but this guy sucks. And... The only time he's useful is if you're fighting a boss and you use the, the Iron Claw weapon or whatever it is. And that, that is pretty powerful, and it takes, you know, it inflicts a lot of damage, but other than that, he, he sucks. I never saw anything redeeming about this guy except for the Iron Claw, that's it. They stole, really? from Kevin, they stole from the Von Erics. I'm, I'm, I'm getting Shadowgate 64 vibes right now. Oh, come on, it's not that bad. I yeah. might rage quit, I don't know. Well, at least this game has good music. Yeah, that's true. That's Boy, very, that, you very true. that is very true. At least you can listen and enjoy the track while you're playing. That's what I was doing. Oh, Shadowgate 64. It's such a... Oh, good times. Epic failure, yeah. <laughs> Epic failure. I mean, yeah, the game, but I mean, our commentary was... Oh, it was quite opposite. Yeah. I don't, I, I, another... Uh, so there's going to be three of them, because it's three. <laughs> this is scary. I want my mummy. I want my mummy back. <laughs> oh yeah, it makes it worse because I'm using this idiot. You should game over on purpose. You should have gamed over on purpose. I, I want to try, you know, I want to prove that I'm not a complete loser in life. I can actually beat certain <laughs> games without ECW mode, so. No, it's funny how to me, you use ECW modes on games that are actually quite harder than this game. 
or easier. Well, I don't know. For I a hard game, this like game this. I can beat this game easier than I can Double Dragon 2. How? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's so weird. Like, I don't yeah, need. I don't uh, can either, honestly. This game, I, I, this game ain't really harder than Double Dragon 2, at least to me. Everybody has their own uh, learning curve, uh, difficulty curve, I guess, whatever. Like, Venom, make, a lot of people said Mega Man 9 was pretty challenging, but Venom goes, Psh! it's easy. Oh, all right, here we go, the boss of the game. It's a trap! Purple yeah. spell. Yes. Yeah. She, she said it first, it's a trap. My favorites. <laughs> yeah. Women are evil. Now I got the Iron Claw out. What now? Whoa. Oh. Whoa. She just... Yeah, that's what. Pop yeah, that's across right. the room. It's because she's really a man. Oh, shit. I got pwned. Game over. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, jeez. Now Billy's getting whooped by his girlfriend here. Come on. Yeah. What's he whipped? Oh, well, this, is, this is better than mummies. Yeah. Sounds like a spin-off. Mummies. Jeez. Oh, ah! Oh, oh, now that was cheap! That was cheap. That was, cheap. that was like 25 cents right there. I want it back. <laughs> oh, you got slain. Alright. No more nunchucks now. Cyclone power. Can't slap. Ah! I've got pwned by a dub. Spawn down music here is... I mean, it's pretty cool, but it's just... Way different from the... The theme of the game, I guess. It's, it's the, the final battle! I know, but... Oh! When she flies right there near, well, 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 unlike how I'm doing, um, it reminds me of that boss in the second uh, stage boss in Kung Fu Kid for the Sega Master System. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Don't pretend like you don't know. It's okay. That's true. I never watched that video. Well, I did do a time. Oh, to, well, shameless plug. Time to play Kung Fu Kid that, that I did like six years ago. <laughs> shameless plug. Yeah, it was quite long ago. That's before my long time to play series, it should be under that. But anyway. What just happened with all that switching around? Did you did you put in the Konami code? No. Did you put in the acclaim code? No. Yeah, right. <laughs> the only code on game facts, I think the only code is in this game is like uh you can't continue when you get game over. Back to the stage, you gotta hear a certain command or something like that. There's no invincibility code, I mean other than game genie. I bet even the Game Genie codes were like shit to just make the game harder. <laughs> yeah. It's one of those asshole things. You know what? This game sucks, so we're going to make it suck even worse. Mm. It happens. Oh, jump, you idiot! You're a ninja! You can't jump? What's this, Wrath of the Black Manta? Mmm, <laughs> Wrath of the Black Manta. Say, Jamie will say Schwarzenegger, and then he'll say, Oh, can you delete that? <laughs> 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 Uh, hey, it's not my fault. I almost said that bad word. Well, I mean, not hey, that we know. It was earlier days of YouTube. Earlier yeah. days. Yeah. <laughs> that was back in the day. Yeah. Exactly. Get the fuck out of here. Come on, jeez. Well, you come on, beat her quicker. I'm trying to. Oh, well, I fell. Oh, jeez, he's our last hope. Come on, Chin, do something useful once in your pathetic life, and actually do something right in this game. Share some of your chocolate with her. <laughs> I don't you get know it. he's got chocolate. Look at him. He's got chocolate. Come on, Jay. What do you say? Well, all right, I'll do the best I can. Ah, oh, come on, what have you had, bud? Don't just jump at her. Oh, 
There you are. <laughs> oh, did we not go? <sighs> oh, I no, it's, I I don't, I don't get this. How how are you supposed uh, to beat this bitch? There's no way you could beat this bitch without any kind of cheats. There should be a life bar. Really. Yeah, I know, right? That's what I was thinking. I was like, you don't know. It seems like forever. It's like, come on, like, come on, you can't be serious. Like, 20 hits, I feel like I'm fighting Krang and Ninja Turtles 2. No, Krang's, I think but Krang's then, oh, easier. You use your jumpscouts five times. What the? What? I think, uh, yeah, I know. I think it's like. I guess they just break after you use them five times. Yeah, and Ninja Turtles 2, you can, uh, like, I think you had to. I don't know how many jump kicks to beat Crane. And on here, it's like, I, I can understand. It's like, uh, it's like 213 or something like that. I think it is, like a ridiculous amount. And on here, yeah, how do nunchucks? How do you run out of nunchucks? I can understand running out of shurikens, yeah, but you throw them and they land against the wall or go somewhere. But, I mean, like, and then the Iron Claw, what, does it just disintegrate after five uses? I don't get it. Maybe it bends, you know? Thanks do wear out after a while. Maybe she's a Maybe stone cold bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you'll run out of bare hands. Oh jeez. Bare hands? Oh. Good thing he's not here. Well, I don't know. You end up dying before that, probably. Yeah. Jinchi was here be like, hey, well, Ronnie, you make like probably any player that hasn't studied the game extensively. This is ridiculous. Yeah. The Jinchu is here to be like, come on, Ronnie. <laughs> Take this phone and make him go back to the kitchen. Going back to the Double Dragon 2 thing, uh, the last boss was not near this uh, <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah, pretty not at all. When I was a kid, I did beat Double Dragon 2 legit. I beat both, the, and the only one I did not beat beat at all when I was a kid was the first one. And uh, years later, when I got Game Genie and ECW mode, yeah, but I don't know. I mean, for some reason, I can I can beat this one legit, and I I can beat Double Dragon two again legit. I said, like, finally beat I legit. Wow. Double Dragon's defeated Princess no Noiram. No, that's Marion backwards. I see what they did there. <laughs> Smart. It's right, okay, so like she uh she was killed in the second one. But then like brought back to life and then now she was evil princess or something. Yeah, well, I don't know if she was killed in the second one, I think maybe they wanted to believe that and she's just unconscious. I don't know. Maybe she was killed and brought back to life. I don't know, she keeps getting killed and kidnapped. I'm chronologically confused. Me too. <laughs> Kidnap her after they killed her? That maybe. Um, this old hag, she got what she deserved. <laughs> we guy. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, that's the end of Double Dragon 3 The Sacred Stones for the NES. And I'll go ahead and start, start the let's discuss here. Um, this game is not as bad as people say it is, and of course when AVGN says the game is bad, people want to jump on the bandwagon. Yeah, it does suck because he said so. So does Simon's Quest. And no, go. Uh, that's one of the reasons why, uh, one of the things I like about Master Hand, he's a good reviewer that was fair. He said he was reviewing Ninja Turtles, and guess who bashed Ninja Turtles? AVGN. So a lot of people said it sucked, pretty much because AVGN said it did, and so did Irate Gamer. And the thing is, uh, 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 what's the name? Master Hand said, look, if you hate a game, hate it because you hate it, not because someone else does. So with Double Dragon 3, I feel the same way. A lot of people hate on it. Yeah, it's not as good as Part 2. It's not the best in the series. It, there's an embarrassing typo, Bimmy and Jimmy Lee at the beginning. But they don't take away from the fact that the game has good graphics, good music, controls not that bad, and it, it implemented a fresh concept to the series. You got to play two new characters. Yeah, one of them really sucked. But at least it was something fresh, something new. Oh, cool, you get to play as two different people this time. You know, four different characters to choose from instead of the same old Billy and Bimmy and Jimmy. And so, yeah, Double Dragon 3 uh, wasn't that bad. And I played it a lot when I was a kid. 
and I like the different boss battle music uh, musics, different boss battle tracks. Throughout each stage, you had different boss battle track. That was pretty cool. Mix it up a little bit. So yeah, and this game is fairly challenging to me. I still think part one and two is harder. And but yeah, I had I had some decent fun with this game as a kid. Uh, I think my favorite thing about this game definitely is the track, the soundtrack. I really loved stage four, probably maybe my favorite uh, track in the game, the stage and the boss battle music. And stage five has some had a, some good tracks as well. In the end, this game really ain't that bad. I give it a seven out of ten. We got. Yeah, well, I haven't, I haven't played much of this game. I haven't uh, gone past, like, the first stage, you know. It's um, definitely, to me, uh, the hardest. Right, Probably right next to the first one. Two is the easiest to me. But, yeah, this just had, a, I guess to most people, uh, just a larger uh, difficulty curve compared to the previous two. And because of that, that probably really just doesn't help the... I don't know the reputation that's gone. I mean, yeah, as you said, it's it's, it's a, it looks great, it sounds great. I mean, got some at least some different characters, you know, tried new things, and you know, it overall is just pretty much great in all aspects besides its difficulty. But I mean, it's probably not the hardest. I'm sure, just if you get the spinning kicks down and all, you can get through the game. I'm sure, there's a way to master it and get through it. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it looks like a solid. It's a solid game, just not, yeah, just that difficulty is what will turn some people down, but I'm sure one day I'll be able to get through it, because I've been some harder games, but uh, yeah, I would probably uh, probably give it the same, about a 7, even having not played all the way through, it would probably earn that score. Definitely the soundtrack, best part, for sure. Yeah, to me, the reason why, I'm one of the reasons why I think this game is easier than Part 2, Part 2, the, the AI was more intelligent because they didn't run into your cyclone kicks almost all the time like the enemies do in this game. And oh, another cool thing about this game, the weapons you get, you get to use, nunchucks, even though it sucks, you only use it five times, but I guess they wanted to add to the challenge. You fused all the time, be too easy, I guess. And then, you know, shurikens, the iron claw, you know, different weapons in the game. I know Double Dragon 2 and 1 and 2 you can use different weapons too, but I mean like, as far as like your character's own custom weapon, that was pretty cool too, so Technos or Acclaim, whoever made this game. Technos. At least they tried, you know, to really make make it different and uh, from part one and two. So I give credit for that. J-Man? The only good thing about this game is the music. It sucks. It failed horribly. I played it when I was like 12 when it first came out. Um, it was difficult, but that's not the problem. The problem is that you only get to use your nunchucks five times. That's stupid! <laughs> it's got nunchucks! You can use them! Yeah. Even in even in uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, which you guys are referencing, Michelangelo gets to use his nunchucks more than five times. Yeah. And you know what? If you're going to have something that's limited to a number of stuff, well, then have pickups. I know... Uh, you know, everything else in the Double Dragon series didn't have pickups, but you know what? Uh, the other Double Dragon games didn't have uh, weird uh, Mariah's spelled backwards evil princesses <laughs> that bitch your nuts with the snake. Yeah. They didn't have uh, graphics that looked like they were trying to go back to the first Double Dragon, um, but failed miserably. Uh ugh. This game isn't even worth me ranting any more about it, but based on music, I'll give it a 4 out of 10. All right. Purple? Um, I give this a 10 out of 10 because the final boss is a chick and you get to fight Sub-Zero and Scorpion. Mm-hmm. All right, cool. She doesn't count. But, yeah, but, I don't count. Well, like, the way... <laughs> Anyway. But see, the, the way yeah. Marion was beating Billy in the game is how it pretty much is with Purple and J-Man in real life. And that's why J-Man hates this game. Purple loves it. Well, okay, you know what? I want to add one more thing. Yeah, I throw flaming doves at him when we have fights. <laughs> well, that would actually be awesome. But I do want to add one more thing. Um, this game, I don't consider this game challenging. It's bullshit. It's bullshit challenging. Um, challenging is like Battletoads, where you got to use your brain to actually, you know, figure the game out. This is just 
stand in the middle and do spin kicks. Stand in the middle and do spin kicks. If you try to actually play this game like straight up, you'll get your fucking ass kicked. I've seen playthroughs of this game, and people do the same thing. They spam, uh, you know, they, they either spam spin kicks, or they get um, they, they get uh, the enemies in a corner and kick the shit out of them. Yeah. It's, that's, that's not challenging. That's just, that's bad AI. Yeah, but the, the game, AI, the AI does BS, though, as far as, like, being cheap. You've seen how the cheap tactics they use against yeah. me and... And especially, right, that's what I'm saying. You can see, I mean, you got to you got to spam them one way or another. It's it's like a it's 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 like a shitty Street Fighter port or a shitty damn it, <laughs> shitty. <laughs> yeah, it's like uh, shitty shitty Fighter 2000. I miss Ray. Somebody make that game, spam and I'll give it a six out of ten. Spam them before they spam you. Yes. All right. So that would do it for. Let's play Double Dragon 3 for the NES. We're out of here. I'm Ron Moore. The Wii guy. Hey, man. And the uh, Silent Purple. And No, she said it. Oh, sorry. I didn't hear it. Yeah, I heard it. And Snowflake. Swing, swing. All right. God bless. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye.